Hey guys, as always, thanks for tuning in. So I'm just gonna give you a quick demo of the new Pixelcade Pulse Arcade lighting effects. Uh, this is installed in an II Arcade cabinet. On the left and right side, we've got LED strips. These are both independently controlled. We've got LED speaker rings. So these are speaker grill replacements with embedded LEDs. And we've got a little effect matrix here in the middle. And then we also have this Retro 7 segment display, and that's actually telling you the year that the game was released. So as we change games in this demo, you can see Frogger came out in 1981, for example. Uh, let's see, the next game was 1980. This was Defender. Um, each of these animations is specific to the game. So we don't have animations for every game, but for the iconic games from the 80s, we've tried to do custom animations. So all the ones you see in this demo are custom for that particular game. If you have a game that doesn't have a custom animation, it will display random effects, but it will match the color, the dominant color of the artwork of that game. So if the artwork of that game had a lot of green, then you'll see a random effect, but all the effects will be green matching that game. This is a work in progress of an installation in a Rec Room Masters cabinet. And this one is kind of interesting because the T-molding you see on the side is actually a special T-molding to fish an LED strip through. So the LED strip is actually inside the T-molding itself, uh, which is a really cool effect. So we've got this integrated now with some of the in-game effects as well. So see as I hit the fire button, you see a little LED strip animation go. And if I shoot something, see a little explosion animation go as well. So while this is displaying, I can just give you a closer look at how these displays look, for example, so you can kind of see from the side there. So they're all flush mount. They don't stick out very far. Um, the seven segment display is actually recessed behind the display, so that doesn't actually stick out at all. Um, I really like these LED strips because they kind of have a built-in diffuser. And um, so you don't really see the circuitry. You're just seeing this kind of white strip when everything is off. This actually is one LED strip, but it's divided up into two zones. And we've told the software that there's two zones that ignore the LED strips in the back. That's another example of a generic one. So everything there is blue, matching the dominant color of the marquee. We will have these um, LED ring speaker grills for sale, these um, matrix effects panels for sale. If you have a larger cabinet that has more space here, we have a, this is an eight by eight, but we also have an eight by 32 that actually has some, uh, some nicer effects just cause you've got the additional real estate. You can do scrolling text as well. So once everything is off, so that's how it looks. So you just see this kind of black mat. Here's the LED strips I was talking about. These all add a link. You can get these on Amazon, but I think these are really nice because Again, it's kind of got a built-in diffuser, so you don't have to do that yourself. You can just put some double-sided, really thin double-sided sticky tape, and it's um, fairly simple to install. So that's kind of a nice look there.